Now, the third drill I've got. I'm going to take a guess because I see a little something over here between the two golf balls. Well, it's Orlando. What is party this time. <laughs> party time. You have to have a balloon for party time. Look, one of the things we have to learn in golf is what's called external shoulder rotation. I'm okay, going to want a bit of help for you in a moment. But you can buy things that hold your arms together. I don't like those. I actually like getting a balloon, putting it between the arms, and there's a reason I prefer a balloon to a ball. A balloon, look at this, it's pretty easy to squash it. Now, I'm pushing both elbows together there. I'm not going to do that when I hit the golf ball. I'm just going to push my trail elbow towards my lead elbow. And where do I do it? Well, I actually do it, and so do all the good players, by the way. When I've gone to the top, my initial move down, it's external shoulder rotation is the name. For those that want it simpler, squash the balloon. I prefer that one. As I shift the weight, I'm trying to squash that balloon. I'm trying to feel that my trail elbow closes in on my lead elbow. That trail shoulder extension is something that just about all good players have. Can you hit the ball like this? You can. You may not hit it well, but yes, you can. I won't go at full speed. In transition, I'm going to try and squash that balloon. In transition, I'm going to try and squash yeah. that balloon, keep the elbows together. Uh, this is a drill you must do now. It's a good external rotation.